Hello everyone, my name is Mr. Neo King, and welcome back to Let's Play Final Fantasy IX. So last time we left the uh, group and we gotta go save the princess now. So let's go do that. Oh shoot, I almost forgot. I have to, start, I have to show this off here. Actually, we get cool music over here anyways. So, in this game, you've got things called abilities, right? And that's really cool. And what they are, pretty much, is first, you want to equip all the best armor and weapons you can. Because they actually um, are how you learn different items. So, we all know Zidane's fine. Uh, what do you have over here? You can't even wear a rest. Jeez, you're terrible. Oh, we got the rubber helmet. Wait, is that better? Bug killer. Okay, I'm going to leave this on because we need that. So, all these items, as you can see down in the bottom there, the uh, S thing that says bird killer, bug killer, beast killer. And you have the thing next to it. So, what that does is that actually teaches you a, um, a weapon. Or a uh, ability, but some of us already have that, so, hold on. Actually, I, jeez, Silk Shirt teaches Thunder and Cure, so without a doubt, I'm actually gonna give him, I'm gonna give him a leather shirt, go back to him and give him the Silk Shirt. Cause he kinda needs that a lot more, he needs Thunder and all that. But now I can show you what I mean. <clears throat> so here I am. So, um, to equip the ability, you go over here to equip. Uh, we don't have any. But you can see we have that. Uh, let's see. Here we go. So protect girls. Um, I actually don't know, even know what this ability does. Uh, flee gill. So you don't drop gill when you flee. That's pretty much what that one is. And you can see those ability points up at the top. Those like blue sphere or octagon or however many there are. Here we have bird killer and bug killer. And then beast killer. So Steiner's pretty much going to be on point for this, uh, this little forest we're at. And that's pretty much abilities. It's, uh, it's not that hard. Uh, pretty self-explanatory that's why they don't give you much of a tutorial on it but uh then the biggest thing i was thinking about uh when i was starting this this morning was like how much do i want to farm here because farming here is pretty useful it's probably the easiest place in the entire game to farm because everything's about one hit and it drops pretty decent xp for where you're at in the game so uh I, I really didn't know what i wanted to do here like see that was one hit even for steiner who doesn't have a good weapon yet and like you get about 23 XP here, so. Not enough to level them up, but still a good chunk of XP, because one more uh, kill will obviously, like, level them up. So this place is really good to farm. However, I'm missing a party member, so I'd rather not. But here we got an active time event. Orchestra in the forest. Orchestra. Okay, let's really liven the place up. Yeah, so. Boost morale. Brum, brum, brum. And here comes boss. Hey, not bad. Yeah. I'm gonna take go take a look around. Stay on your toes. We'll be leaving soon. Yeah, so. I don't know. That one's just always funny, too. So, Last time we got here and we couldn't go past this. So now we can. Let's go see what's up. Oh. It's just a battle. Oh, my goodness. So today is Sunday. Like usual, I always say that. Um... First week of college is over. I don't think I even recorded since college, have I? Oh, I can show this off. Fire uh, magic. So what that does is, um, if you have Vivi, yeah, Vivi, Vivi and uh, Steiner in the same party, you can cast a magic sword spell on Steiner like that. So, I mean, it's it's pretty overpowered actually. <laughs> so you just do that in your set. So yeah. And, doo -doo -doo, and there they leveled up. See, it's pretty easy. Oh, wow, I just got eye drops. Eye drops are really useful for this uh, boss fight that we have coming up. Or our first boss fight coming up, surprisingly. We still haven't had an official boss fight. You guys realize that? And over here, there's actually a secret area I never even knew about. wonder where this river goes. I never knew about this till just my recent playthrough. It's pretty cool. I, I like that area. I would sleep there. Oh, God, I got sneeze. Oh, jeez. Oh my gosh. I've been sneezing like crazy this morning. I don't know why. Ooh, and here's a new, uh, monster. It's called the... I have no idea what it's called. All I know is we gotta stop it. Ooh, jeez. You may want to, uh, throw a potion at Vivi here. Because he's, uh, he's pretty low on HP. So. <clears throat> Got him. 
Yeah, so you'd still need to watch your HP or your HP around here, especially with those guys, like bigger guys like that, which there are a few of them around here that are kind of troublesome a bit, but still nothing compared to like later areas to farm at. That's why I love I remember the first time I played this game I farmed quite a bit here. Although it was kind of a mistake in the end because I still had to farm anyways, because you know more party members join and then you have to use those people instead of these guys. That's the thing with this game, you can't choose your party members like right at the bat like seven. No, si no signs of monsters here. Yeah. So it's like your safe area. But it's kind of like... <clears throat> I don't know. It, like, you don't get like it. Do as I say, not as I do. It, it's interesting because you do that. And it's just like... You don't get to choose your party uh, members anytime soon. Yeah, don't worry. We'll be out here soon, too. Here, take this map. It's going to be a long trip back to Limbum. Alright, let's see you later. I'm counting on you. And, wow, they're scheming something. <clears throat> But yeah, so, like I was saying, it's just weird, because, like, I think it's not until, like, honestly, probably not until Disc 3 that you actually get to, uh, do anything as far as, like, choosing party members. It's quite some time. So let's go ahead and save here real quick, just to be on the safe side. Let's go ahead and use File 3. I'm going to start doing the, the tiered saving in case, like, one of these videos don't turn out or something. They've been turning out fine. Oh, I got to check Mognet. Give Monty a letter. Yeah, okay, so right here we got Monty. A letter from Koopo. Thanks for delivering, Koopo. From Koopo to Monty. I think Queen Brach is up to something, but I suspect Princess Garnet even more. Koopo, she might leave home soon with a with a prince on the uh, white horse. Maybe it's just in my imagination. Prince Garnet? Princess Garnet didn't she just... Oh, never mind, Koopo. So, do you have anything? You have no mail. All right. No, no, I didn't, I didn't want to read. Wait. Cold place. I know where he is. Koopo must... There must be something strange going on. Wait, what? I want mail. Hold on. Still, still it's going on ice. I'm so confused. I have no idea what's going on. All right, we did, we did the magnet. That's all that matters. All right, so let's head on up here. And now here we go. We got this cool little cutscene. Actually, we're at the boss fight now. Crap. I should have farmed up a bit more. I didn't realize that's the boss. Well, yeah, if you can tell, there's the boss. Because that's so hard to tell, right? And now we can walk up, and this this looks like it's probably not important, right? They show you that off like it's like going to be a while till you see him, but then you walk right in, and he's right here, and Prince Scar is just laying down over there. There she is. So this is the monster. <laughs> Is going to be a disgrace if a mere bandit should rescue the princess? You think you can handle them on your own? Yeah, it's game baby. Yeah, right there's the boss music. So this is it, guys. This is our first boss fight. The name of this boss is Plant One. <laughs> I don't know. I should probably do some research before I do these videos. I swear to God, I just walk in and go, Let's see, it's Plant One. It's what? I play. Oh, why the fuck? Ugh. I forgot that they changed the uh, party around. I don't know. That's one of the things I hate about this game, too. They always do this crap. Like, they're just like, oh, we're going to change the party around here. Crap. Not blind. So, as you can see, this is why we wanted to do that. Um, This is why I wanted to get these eye drops. Because he uses Paul and you're pretty much done for the uh, round then. But, really, I just got uh, Zidane on it. Because Vivi doesn't need... To be able to see to cast magic. But. So are there my drops on me boy. That pollen like really does a number on you. But luckily Steiner's sword thing. Wait what was that? Oh thunder. Jeez. Oh, yeah you gotta be careful with that one. Uh, I'm gonna try stealing a bit actually. You know what? Yeah let's steal a bit. Dang that damage though man. Alright, so, and then use Fire again. I may have, uh, Vivi use some healing, uh, stuff here, actually. Whew, made it just in time. The first time I played this, I thought he, um, I thought he showed up once you got, like, Shrek enough, but... Oh, Jesus, okay. Okay, yeah, that's... Oh, shit! Well, I didn't want to do that. Oh my god, well, 
some mistakes were made here. And, uh, I'm not gonna blame anyone. But I wasted Phoenix down. Why does this start on Satane? It should start at the top, I thought. Well, what? Who designed this? Also, that tentacle thing freaking gotta be good. Yeah, hold on. Ooh, okay. Well, uh. What do I wanna do here? Uh. Let's throw a high potion on Zidane. Whoops. Zidane, thank you. Combination failed. It failed because Steiner didn't have enough MP. So both Steiner and uh, Vivi need to have enough HP or MP to do that. So I'm just down to basic attacks here pretty much. Unfortunately. Oh my god. <laughs> Getting shrek right now. Focus. Ooh, we got him. So that could have gone a lot sm It's gone smoother in the past, trust me. But uh, yeah. No, age, no XP for that. Yeah, you don't get XP in this game for boss fights, unfortunately. And that is super unfortunate. I really don't understand why they did that. I don't know if it's a does, the, 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 the designer choice, but what? Please kill your house of Zidane. Give her the stuff. Hack, hack. She gonna be okay? Oh, man, what now? Now you got these small dudes coming after you. Let's get out of here. It was just like, whatever. Yeah. This part, I love this part. I love the music. I love everything. And also, these guys will fight you if you actually stop. So, this, these are optional fights. Well, actually, all of them except for one. But, yeah. On, I gotta change the... I gotta change the order. Ooh, stopped it just in time. Right, let's change the order here. I also want to get rid of this... Uh, Status ailment, everyone. I completely forgot to do this in between battles. Shoot. Uh, where are you at? Eyedroppers are here. Okay, get rid of him. Get rid of him. And now we gotta fight this guy. Yeah, there's nothing you can do about that. You you get into that fight regardless because he just gets surrounded. But if you kill the ones in front, which I hope I got. I don't actually. I didn't actually see anything. Uh, you're you're set to go then. So. All right. So don't bother stealing. Just uh. Oh my god. These guys are not playing around, I'll tell you what. However, you do have four party members now, so you're fine. Uh, don't be on Vivi. Alright. So, Blank is taking a beating right now from these guys' thunder. What the frick? I used eye drops on you! You let me down. Guys, we haven't hit one yet. Like, they've just been, like, getting five turns. So there's one definitely dead. Hopefully Steiner and Blank and Z Zidane can take him out. Okay, yeah. Everybody else will be able to take him out. Because Blank is OP in this part. He's supposed to be, so. What did we get? Ooh, we all got level 3 at least. Everybody except for Zidane because he was level 4. Okay, there we go. Whew, thank God it was the ones in front. So let's keep on going now. Zigging around. What are you doing? Yeah, what are you doing? Something's wrong. What? The entire force is coming after us. Blank, take care of the princess. What they, what they, what they mean by this? <laughs> that's like a, that's like a meme that like my buddy uses. Oh, there we go. Now we got the cool cutscene here. The music's so cool here. Oh man, I love this music. And here comes all the roses. Ooh, I see what he means by that. <sighs> but the thing is, I never understood that. He says about taking care of it. It's like he knew that he was going to get swept up, but Blank did that instead. I, I didn't understand that, really. Oh, Blank's just like, take the map. Yeah. You know, how... I'm just going to let play. Yeah, and they have it. Blank is dead. How many times does, like, 
a person you think is a main character who's not the main character, like, die an hour into a game. Like, I don't know. That doesn't happen often. I remember when I was a kid, like, this is the first time playing Final Fantasy. I had no idea that was going to happen. That idiot. Yeah. Yeah, I just, I never, I was, I don't know. I always, it always made me upset because I remember being like, well, I want to get rid of him. Hope she gets well soon. This is all your fault. I don't, Steiner's such a douche. Like, listen, I know he's supposed to be all like, oh, but, the, but like, I don't understand because his Dane literally just lost, like, one of his best friends. Like, he's dead. He's gone. And, like, all Steiner can do is, like, it's all your fault. And it's just like, are you really? It's like, are you sure about that? Because, um, because Blank literally just sacrificed himself for all of you. So. <laughs> what coincidence. We went to snatch her and she wanted to be snatched. Yeah. <sighs> Destroy the campy while it lasts. Yeah, while we get to Lindblum. Vicious monsters he spawns. The abnormal spirits. Princess, we must leave this dangerous place at once. You're a gobby king. She hasn't fully recovered yet. How do you plan to get out of here? We're surrounded by valleys, surrounded by tall cliffs, and the last I heard, North Gate and South Gate are sealed off. Dot dot dot. Yeah, that's what I thought. Oh my god. Roasting him. The princess can barely walk right now. We went through this. You should know. <laughs> my cat's just chilling on my windowsill. I turned around and just saw my cat chilling on my windowsill and it's just like, yep. Sounds good to me. Let's get some rest, yeah. Steiner doesn't do much of a good job either, I'll tell you what. But yeah, I just... That whole forest part really, like, messed with my mind as a child. I was like, why? How you feeling? Yeah. Good, thanks to your messing you gave me. Could this be? Yeah, I'm surprised. Uh, I was surprised, too, after he beat the big plank guy. The forest got completely petrified. His name was Blank. Must go help him. Can't do anything for him now. We'll come back for him. I'm sure there's a way to cure him. Let's get going, yeah. According to the map that Blank gave us. There's a cavern to the south of us. Maybe we can get above the mist through the cavern. Yeah. Are y'all are you all white? <laughs> Take that one. Everything's gonna be fine, trust me. Zen doesn't seem too torn up about what's his name. Uh blank. Wait, Koopo. Oh, it's Monty. I'm very impressed. First time I've seen anyone escape the evil forest. You all must be strong, Koopo. But don't get cocky, there's lots of strong monsters ahead. Before we got into the world, Mogs will teach you a few things. Yeah, so this is what they teach you about what mogs can do in the overworld and all that. And uh, I really don't need to, so. So you can actually, like, find these two guys in game, which I think is really cool. So. Blah, blah, blah. Why well, find them will be cool. I'll show you whenever we get to them. Gift for you, take it. And to Koopo or Moogle Flute. There we go. With this flute, you can call us anywhere in the world. Yeah, there you go. Press X to play it. Happy trails. Or if you're playing on an Xbox, X. Or if you're playing on an Xbox, X. Yeah, there you go. Wakes him up by slapping him. Oh my gosh. Oh. Yeah, your friends are all going rusty. Yeah, there you have it. And here we go. The overworld with the most soothing music ever. So there you go, the Mist Continent. Yeah, now we're in the overworld. It's legit. So, here if you hit square. There you go. You can call it Moogle. You can use your tent and you can save, but this only works in the overworld. Keep that in mind, so. Let's save up here. I'm gonna save over this file just in case something did go wrong. Yeah, look at that. We're already an hour 35 in the game. Holy crap, only like 17 more to go. Alright guys, well thank you all so much for watching. I will see you all in the next video of Let's Play Final Fantasy IX. Bye.